So we move over to Hedock for race 10. It's the Tommy Whittle handicap chase over three miles. So Ascendant Forgotten for Pointy Ball Racing is one. Castle Rock at Go Go for David Robinson is two. Shirataki Stay for Paul O'Neill along with Caribbean Escape are three and four. Grandma's Kalapa for Martin Leadham is five. Silver Bullet along with Luna Mix It Riches for Alex Cherry are six and seven. Pink Champagne for Derek Hinton. Occasionally Castle Nine for Hems. Red Cake for Thomas Rogers is ten. And DeLorean. Ryan Costello is number 11. The starter's got him away. They start on the winning post here at Haydock. A couple of circuits to do to get over these three miles to take the Tommy Whittle. The uh, famous saxophonist who's a jazz man. Whether that's the right Tommy Whittle, we'll never know. But he was the first one that came up under Wikipedia. So Ascendant Forgotten and Silver Bullet are going to lead this. So we swing left handed take the first of 18 fences here at Say Haydock. The leaders are over it. And as the rest of them went straight through the top there was Red Cape for Thomas Rogers. So we, uh, we need to jump better than that for the next 17 fences. So Ascendant Forgotten leads us over the second. A big slow jump at the rear by occasionally Castle the Great. Through half a mile, and it's Ascendant Forgotten and Silver Bullet that lead us. About five from Shirataki Stay up against the fence, Red Cape. And we'll get over that one. A couple of mistakes made. A few of the horses uh, in the mid pack, but they're getting stretched out here. We've not completed a mile yet, and it's Ascendant Forgotten and Silver Bullet by about four or five from Shirataki Stay. And a further length to Red Cape up against the fence, two and maybe a length and a half back to Pink Champagne in the pink silks, and the outside of that is DeLorean and Luna Mixer Riches, and the line of greys, we've got DeLorean, sorry not DeLorean, Castle Rock and Go Go, Grandma's Calapa, who didn't take that one particularly on the outside of that is occasionally Castle, and then the non-grey at the rear is Caribbean Escape in the red silks, red cap, green sleeves, Paul O'Neill, but it's Ascendant Forgotten that leads them, top bend, bit of an oval here at Haydock, as you can see, we're now lining up for the judge again. With two miles to go, it's Ascendant Forgotten. It could ever a plain one. Everybody gets over it, two jumps, really mistakes at the rear from occasionally Castle and Caribbean Escape. We've gone a bit Indian file here, there's probably 20 lengths from first to last, and it's Ascendant Forgotten that leads us from Silver Bullet. Leaders all take the seven, we lost one there, DeLorean's gone. A bit like the cart, which I've mentioned before. You get about four miles and then it will stop. But it's uh, Ascendant Forgotten from Silver Bullet and Shirataki Stay. Red Cape. Maybe one, two, three, four as they go over the eighth. We'll take it well. And we'll come along alongside the grandstand. They're well strung out here. Over this three mile event. At Hedok. But it's Ascendant Forgotten from Silver Bullet. Red Cape and Shirataki Stay take it together. Shirataki stay packed a bit on landing. Then we've got about a length and a half back to the first of the Greys. Castle Rocker, go go. The Davy lad. Inside of that is Pink Champagne running well between horses and Luna Mixer Riches. And further on one and a half length back to Martin Leadham's Grandma's Calapa. And then just the Grey right at the rear at the moment is occasionally casting. We've lost Caribbean Escape for Paul O'Neill. Sorry, I missed that one. Unseated his rider at the last. Uh, jumping particularly well, but we're still being led by the Pontypool machine of Ascendant Forgotten. We've got a length and a half on the Silver Bullet. And Shirataki Stay and Red Cape was a little bit slow over that. They're through 10 of the 18. And eight fences to take, just over a mile to travel. The fence is going to come quite quick as we near the end of the race. The plain one, or jump there by Silver Bullet. Ascendant Forgotten. Shirataki stays, moved himself up into second position now. Starting to stalk for the leader as we come to a plain one. Leader meets it well, rises well. Another poor jump there by Silver Bullet. He drifts back down towards the rear of the pack. So it's Ascendant Forgotten from Shirataki Stay. Red Cape in third. And we've got Luna Mixer, Riches and Silver Bullet. Out wide is Castle Rock and Go Go. Wider still the other grey grandma's collapse. Up against the fence with nowhere to go at the moment is Pink Champagne. And the one that's getting a little bit towed off now as we get towards the six furlong pole is occasionally Castle. 
So it is Ascendant Forgotten and Shirataki State. These are your one, two, and they've got a couple of links on the rest. If you have not asked for anything yet, there's Ascendant Forgotten. Whip out. Start to swing them around this left hand turn and line up for the judge with uh, around about half a mile to go. And it's Ascendant Forgotten by a length and a half from Shirataki State. Trying to make up the ground there's Castle Rock of Go Go along with Grandma's Kalapa. They take the 15th, there's only three to jump. So it's Ascendant Forgotten. Now going to be put, going to be put under a pair pressure from Castle Rock of Goko, Shirataki stays got nothing left, running well now, Pink Champagne and Grandma's Kalapa, they get to the 16th, Castle Rock of Goko's on the haunches now, of Ascendant Forgotten, there's only two to jump, these two are neck and neck, so they approach the necks, and it is Castle Rock of Gogo that's going to take them over it as they get to the penultimate, we're inside the final two furlongs, so it's Castle Rock of Gogo by length and a half from Ascendant Forgotten, Grandma's Kalapa running on well, but Castle Rock of Gogo got away from that well, and takes a four length advantage, coming down to the last jockey he looks round on him, he feels comfortable. It's Castle Rock of Gogo coming up to the last. Don't make a mistake on this one. Looks round again, gets over it. He's inside the final furlong now. Castle Rock of Gogo seems to have plenty left here. Ascendant Forgotten Shirataki State. Luna Mix of Riches running on. But it's a comfortable win here for David Robertson on Castle Rock of Gogo. From Shirataki State who just gets up for a second from their longtime leader, Ascendant Forgotten. Grandma's Kalapa run on for fourth there for Martin Leadham. And the Tommy Whittle goes to Davy Robertson with Castle Rock and Go-Go from Shirataki staying second. And Sender Forgotten was third. Fourth was Grandma's Kalapa for Martin Leadham. And Luna Mixer Riches for Alex Jerry run on for fifth.